hello everyone in this video we are going to see how to use find or create in salesforce chat to search against custom field this is a sample case record where i am using chat notes as testing subject this chat notes is a custom field on case object I have a simple requirement for this video demo where subject should match the value that is in this chat notes field on the case record and it should find that existing case and then it should link it to the chat transcript instead of creating a brand new case. I have existing case where chat notes is testing subject chat notes is my custom field in my pre chat visual force page first I am mapping the chat notes with the case subject here case subject is here type text input field and then I'm using a case subject for mapping it So whatever value that is entered in the chats, uh, sorry, in the case subject should be matched with chat notes. And I am using do find for case and then it should match against chat notes. I am using exact match chat notes true. So it should match the exact uh, uh, value. So that is the purpose of using chat notes comma true for is exact match. Next, in the do create for the case, I am using chat notes is true. So first I am mapping the chat notes field with the subject. Next, I am using do find to find against chat notes and I'm making sure it is exact match. So I'm using chat notes comma true for this exact match. And when I use do create, I'm using chat notes comma true. So let's initiate a chat. I'm going online in Omni channel. Okay. The subject should be the same subject so that it will match this case and then it should create a chat transcript for me. So it linked this new chat transcript to this existing chat 1170 since the chat notes matched with the subject on, on the chat transcript or on the pre-chat. So in the pre-chat visual force page in the map map the custom field next in the do find use the custom field to search against it if you wanted to have exact match then use is exact match next in the do create use the custom field comma true so that it will update its value since the value is going to be the same it won't update but it will consider that Please check the video description. In the video description, you should be able to get the sample code which we referenced in this video. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.